The Kremlin is preparing for the heaviest of battles as a massive counteroffensive bears down on Kherson, the largest city under Russian control. Ukrainian forces have been making advances against the invaders, leading some to suggest that Russia was in retreat. But now Vladimir Putin's forces are digging in to defend the Kherson Oblast, one of the four regions he attempted to annex after self-described referenda. The city itself has been in Russian hands since the early days of the war. It's the only regional capital to have fallen since the invasion began. Ukraine's advance has been met with intensifying Russian missile and drone strikes on civilian infrastructure far from the front lines. These have destroyed around 40% of Ukraine's power system, with winter fast approaching. As the gateway into the annexed Crimean Peninsula, Kherson holds a strategic significance for Moscow. Defeat in the region could spell doom for its so-called special military operation in Ukraine. Russian-installed authorities have told civilians to leave the city ahead of battle, and reportedly tens of thousands of people have been evacuated to the east bank of the Dnipro River. Young men of fighting age are allegedly being offered the opportunity to join the Russians as part of local militia units, but Ukraine says that this is just conscription in disguise. Russia's response to the Ukrainian advance has so far been to target energy infrastructure across the country, leaving more than 1.5 million people without power. According to the EU, this is a war crime, as Russia has resorted to trying to starve or freeze out civilians to force them to surrender. But should this tactic fail and Russia be forced to retreat even further, they would lose their strongest foothold in Ukraine. It would be another humiliating blow for Moscow after a string of defeats on the battlefield, and the balance of war will shift heavily in Kiev's favour. Thank <laughs> you.